Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today we're going to try Positively 4th Street, Bob Dylan. I have no idea what it means, but there you go. You need the capo at the 4th fret. It starts off the intro, it's just the D chord. Just you're going to play that back and forth while the organ's going ba 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 ba. So, uh, my strum is going to be down, down, up, up, down, up. Something nice and easy like that. He just does full measures or patterns on that. The D chord is the 3rd string, 2nd fret, 1st string, 2nd fret, 2nd string, 3rd fret. Okay? That's your intro. That's all you have to do. Alright, the whole rest of the song follows this pattern. It's a D, to an E minor, to a G, to a D. Then D, A, G, B minor, and then A. the whole song. This is the song, uh, You've Got a Lot of Nerve to, uh, I don't know, <laughs> I forget the words. So, I'm the guitar player. Alright, so you got your D chord for a measure, a pattern, E minor, which is the 5th string, 4th string, 2nd fret. And then you got a G chord, I believe, yeah. G is the 6th string, 3rd fret, 5th string, 2nd fret, 2nd and 1st string, 3rd fret. Alright, so a pattern on each one of those chords, then you're back to the D chord. Now the next measure is a bit tricky. He stays on the D chord, but just does like half a pattern. So our pattern now is going to be down, down, up on the next few chords. So it's down, down, up, then an A chord, then a G chord, then a B minor. So that little part is the tricky part. It's D for down, down, up, then an A chord for down, down, up which is the 4th, 3rd, and 2nd string at the 2nd fret. And then you're back to the G chord, which we talked about. And then the dreaded B minor chord for some of you. You bar the 2nd fret, 2nd uh, string, 3rd fret, 4th and 3rd string at the 4th fret from the capo I'm talking about. Uh, my first finger is going to be smushed up into that 6th string to mute it. Again, short strum on that one. Then you're on to the A chord, which we already talked about. Now this gets two full patterns. Okay? You can do stuff on the A chord like you could, uh, you could add your pinky on the 2nd string, 3rd fret to make a sus4 like... Stuff like that. You could, uh, you could add it, go back to the A, and then lift up the 2nd string for a sus2 and then back. So something like... All kinds of stuff you can do on that A chord. This moment there, because it's the end of the lyric, and um, it's a chance for you to put something in there. Okay? So the whole song is D for pattern. You got a lot of nerve, E minor, to say you are my friend is G to D. And then D to the A, G to the B minor, and then the A. Okay? That's the whole song. Uh, you would end on a D chord if you have, don't have the ability to fade out, <laughs> okay? Uh, but that's the whole song, a uh, nice easy one, except for the B minor, sorry. Um, but I think the original key is like F sharp, so by putting the capo, you're able to do the folk chords for the most part that, uh, that he does, um, you know, in the song. So, uh, any questions, comments down below? Uh, thanks for watching and play more guitar.